My name is Kyla Pere. I'm the education consultant and SmartBoard trainer for presentation products, and I'm going to show you how to use the attachments tab within Smart Notebook software. The attachments tab is located over on the side. It's the tab that looks like a paper clip. If I click once on it, you can see that it will open up. And it's a great way uh, to really make your presentations and lessons more cohesive. The Attachments tab allows you to link in supporting documents, software, uh, web pages, or even other notebook files directly into uh, your current smart notebook file that you have open. Down at the bottom, you have your insert button. And this is how you insert either your copy of file, hyperlink, or your shortcut to file. I'm going to click on the very first option, Insert Copy of File. And this is going to open up and allow me to browse anywhere on my computer for my supporting documents. Once you've found the document that you want to add in, just click once on it and hit Open. And now this becomes a permanent part of my uh, notebook file. This is also a great way if you're sharing your notebook file with a colleague or with another teacher they're now going to have access to all of your attachments that you've added in. To open this up, just double click on it. And you can see it opens up directly to my Word document. When I'm through with the document, maybe I'm using it in class, just hit close. And you can see it's going to stay right there in your attachments tab within this one notebook file. Down at the bottom, I'm going to select the insert button again. And I'm going to insert a hyperlink. This time, I'm going to add in the website that I want to go to. So, www.presentationproducts.com. Let's make sure we have it spelled correctly. You want to give it a display name. So, presentation products. And once you're through, hit OK. This will add in your web page. By double clicking on it, it will open it up and navigate directly to it. This will save you time in class because you're not having to search all over the internet or Google search things. You can find the website that you need, add it in as your attachment, and then just simply double click on it in your attachments tab to open it up. Your last option is insert shortcut to file. Remember, this is only going to insert as a shortcut. So if you are sharing this with other teachers, you may want to only consider the copy of file option instead of shortcut to file. It works the same way. It's going to allow you to browse your computer, find the document that you need, and then hit open. After you've inserted it in, you can see that it's going to tell you it is a shortcut. Same thing as before. Double click on it to open up the supporting file. That's all the time that I have for today. If you have any questions or if you would like to contact us, please feel free to email me at kparay at pproducts.com. Also available by phone at 212-736-6350. Or you can visit our website at presentationproducts.com.